This evening marks the beginning of Rosh Hashanah. It's the Jewish New Year and a particularly special time for members of a synagogue in Milford who were displaced from their place of worship by a fire late last year. This evening, they're returning. News 12 Connecticut's Vanessa Murphy is at the Hebrew congregation of Woodmont Chabad. And Vanessa, they've been rushing to get at least part of the facility ready for this holiday. You can see the construction workers are gone as they finish the job so this door can open for this high holy day. About 100 members of the congregation are expected this evening. This is down to the wire. Just hours before families arrive for the Jewish New Year Rosh Hashanah. We're coming right to the end. Workers rush to get this hall ready. It looks like we're going to make it. A fire last October caused major damage inside the synagogue. There was less damage in the hall next door, so renovations started there. Phase two and three are, are these additions here. The president of this Hebrew congregation, Joel Levitt, says it's a $1.7 million project, which is mostly funded by donations. People have been very generous. Now that generosity is paying off. It's very exciting. Builder Jim Pino is relieved his team met the deadline. It does get a little hectic. While for Levitt's... It's really for the next generation. This is a new year. It makes it all worthwhile. And a new beginning for the Jewish community in Milford. It's really um, a beautiful thing to be opening on the, on the high holy days. This is a registered historic building, so repairs they make adhere to the building's motif. In Milford, Vanessa Murphy, News 12, Connecticut.